Hello. I hope y'all don't see my coochie. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> y'all. Hey, look. And I hate that. Ah! The stress. Can you read this? Hey baby! Hey babies, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Eva, aka Girls of Self Love, aka Nedrin Doll. And I'm glad you found me. Don't live without subscribing. So in today's video, I will be giving you guys the collective haul. Babies, I'm so excited. Okay, pardon, pardon me, okay? Is this is this me or are we excited because this is our first ever sit down video in 2024 i'm so excited because let me tell you baby i thought that we would be doing the first ever sit down video in our new apartment but let me tell you sometimes things do not go as planned okay so i had to pause the house hunting series and bring to you guys the ultimate first ever sit down video Okay. so i know how you guys love the fashion videos so much so i decided to show you guys a couple of stuff okay i have been doing a lot of boxings you guys know that one thing about me i will invest in a statement piece i will invest in like cute outfits so yeah i wanted to show you guys hold on some of the stuffs are not here i'm gonna go out and grab it and i'm gonna be right back okay yeah so we're back so as i was saying i know that my babies love love my fashion videos the sit down videos and it's been a long time coming okay we have not done any sit down videos since january and today is january alexa what day is it today is saturday february 17th okay it is february 17th and we have not had any sit down videos since 2024 okay i had to i took matters into my own hands i said you know what the babies need a sit down video okay so without further ado i will be showing you guys some of my latest additions to my wardrobe i have been doing a lot of unboxings one thing about me baby i'm gonna buy something fresh especially when it comes to outfits especially when it comes to accessories i've been feeling so guilty doing all these unboxings and i was like how the hell am I not showing my babies all this new stuff, okay? So I said, you know what? I'm gonna show you guys some of the new stuff that I have. I have put together some stuff in different categories. So for this video, this is what I'm gonna show you. Do you think we should try this on, okay? Uh, let me know if you want me to try this on. I think uh, when I'm done showing you guys the outfits, I'm gonna decide if I'm gonna try it on or not. So I think we should start from the small, from the little ones. Let's start from this other bag. Hold on. Ta-da! So this contains a couple of dresses. Um, let me show you guys. This is from my friend's uh, collab. Two of my besties had a collaboration called the Juliet Moses and Sabrina Bella collection. And it, it's been doing pretty well, okay? So before that, let me show you guys real quick this glasses okay this is a dupe from i think balenciaga or bottega i can't remember what brand but i got this uh last month and it's like i feel like i have the craziest collection of shades but i never get to wear them because i'm like oh my god i want to show off my pretty face i want to show off this face card that never declines but which people's face card really declines when i think about it <laughs> not me though but yeah um i caught this a while ago and i was saving it saying i'm gonna use it to debut my body aesthetic on instagram guess who hasn't done that me okay this house hunting has literally been ruining a lot of things in my content calendar but you know we're changing that okay we move new house or not okay uh, i don't want to put this because i don't want to ruin my makeup but let's do this okay <laughs> I know you I know you get the point. I know you see this shit. Hello? 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 I know you see this. <laughs> I 
I love the shades, okay? I, I can't wait to wear it. I can't, you guys know every year I give you one unorthodox type of outfit, type of situation. <laughs> Just wait on it, okay? Um, so I, I told you guys I'm gonna show you accessories first. And uh, yeah, um, I don't know. Uh, you you guys know that everyone I'm here, if you're a new viewer, I want you to know that everyone I'm here is my baby. And if you want to become my baby, just click on that subscribe button, whether you want to become my baby or not, of course. Uh, I don't know what, are you, what you're waiting for. So um, the next on the list, we have this cute pair of earrings. A bit, let me tell you, I've probably gotten like at least six pairs of earrings uh, just in the month of January, but I wanted to show you guys this one especially because of what it says. This is my 2024 mantra, you guys. Can you read this? I hope this is focusing. Do you do you see? Can you read that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That is my mantra for 2024, and this is I don't know when I saw this earring I just said I'm gonna cop it because what am I waiting for because <laughs> this is the vibe okay and the girlies love the vibe yeah uh, moving on um, we have uh, this cute set of bodysuit that my friend gifted me um, it is a mesh top I've only had one mesh top in my wardrobe for the longest one black mesh top that has been literally dying like if the mesh top mesh top could speak you would literally say eva i'm tired let me go set me free so tell me why i mean that would explain why i was so elated so happy when my friend i don't know if you guys watched the polo vlog that's the last vlog on the channel if you watched it you will see where i was unboxing the outfit uh, that was you know the, the Juliet Moses outfit and this came in the bag with it but I never I didn't see it until my friend said did you see the tops in there so I had to go back and say oh my god my friend gifted me she gifted me and the stretch on this thing the stretch on this thing is sickening okay I also love the ribbon detailing it is not like your typical type of bodysuit uh, that y'all be seeing that you'll clip. I feel like the Fupa girlies <laughs> This is just gonna benefit the Fupa girlies. I'm gonna ask my friend where this is from by the way because instead of bending down and trying to like look at your Fupa, look at your coochie and try to like clip it This is very easy because you can either tie it or just tuck it in. Okay, so we have it in black Okay, and we have it in like nude-ish beige type of color I absolutely love it because it, it's not like the typical mesh quality that feels like it's not soft on your body. This is quite soft and quite stretchy. And yeah, so moving on, the next thing we have. Can y'all guess what this is? If you've gotten to this part of the video and you still have not subscribed, what are you doing? No, tell me, what are you doing? Okay. <sighs> Should we unbox this together? Of course we're gonna unbox it together, okay? Um, I still have not decided if I'm trying on this outfit, by the way. I just wanted to show you guys, okay? But we'll, we'll see. Just tell me, tell me to please try it on. Comment right now if you want me to try it on. Comment, so let's unbox this together. Yeah, so this is a cute, cute dress. I got this dress from a store, a lifestyle store called Ariaba Lifestyle. And what was so beautiful about this outfit, I know, I promise, I know it doesn't make sense now when you look at it, but on my body, it does make a lot of sense, okay? Um, it's very uncommon for me to see like sexy outfits like this, to just see my exact size in store. It either has to be like couture or pre-ordered or like uh, an RTW type of situation. But yeah, this was just in my exact size when I walked in. And I said, let me tell you, I am definitely, definitely copying this. After getting my friend Sabrina her birthday gift, I was about walking out from the store when I said, I'm going to see this dress in my dream. 
So I said, you know what? Get back and pick up that dress. And that's exactly what I did, okay? So uh, moving on, the next outfit we have here is this cute tweed dress. Um, the story behind this outfit, I don't know if you guys remember my Sheen Scam video where I was upset that a group of people were impersonating Sheen and they made me pick a bunch of outfits. And I picked, this was the particular outfit I remember picking that I was anticipating for them to ship me, ship to me, only for it to turn out that they were scammers. So I remember uh, my friend Sabrina wearing a tweed outfit and I asked her where it was from. And she said Sheen, and she ended up gifting it to me. And I was so happy. I showed you guys this in the vlog but I have not uh, tried it on. So I guess I'm gonna have to try this on for my babies, okay? Um, moving on, this particular top, this is the cutest, okay? This top is from the Juliet Moses and Sabrina Bella collab. They are my two besties and I'm super proud of them. This is yet another mesh up. I guess this is this is the year of mesh up. If you're a meshed up girly, say hi to me in the comments right now. This makes me so happy because it has like this uh ruffle detailing on the side. I, I hope this is focusing well and I hope you guys can see it. Uh, what I like about this. It says by Jillian Moses. Yeah. So what I love about this is it has like a glittery effect. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see from the flash, but in the dark though, you can see pretty well. This has an awesome stretch as well. Okay. <laughs> so moving on, um, I decided that I was going to pair it with this pants. This pants are thrifted by the way. And you guys know the thing about leather. Oh my God, oh my God, the heat has killed my pants. Oh my God! No! I got this pants in December, you guys, and I really wanted to wear it. But look, look now, the heat is ruining it. Guess we're still gonna wear it like that. <laughs> me, because everything is art to me. I don't care. If you like change color 10 times, I'm still gonna wear you. I don't care. I probably use it to take pictures or something. But yeah, moving on. I have this cute, cute number here. This is the main character of this collective haul, okay? You guys know that beige nude uh, chocolate brown, light brown, earthly tones are my all-time favorite colors. They've been my all-time favorite colors before it became a thing on the streets of social media. All of a sudden, everyone's aesthetic is beige nude. There was a time, if you followed me two years ago, you see that there was a time where my feed literally has the white and beige consistency, like aesthetic going on on my page. But anyway, I just, I just love this, okay? I love it so bad. Um, I'm going to try it on. It's a gift as well from my friend, Juliet Moses. This makes me so happy. I always say that uh, people don't spoil me. But actually, doing this haul made me realize that my friends do spoil me. And I love them. I love them so much, okay? Um... So moving on, I have this outfit. This outfit, uh, let me open it. I don't think I'm gonna try this particular outfit on, but let me show you guys, okay? So this particular outfit, I was searching my wardrobe and I was like, when the hell did I buy this? And it's gorgeous. It's like wool, but it's like, it's knitted, woolen, but I don't know. It just feels like one of them Chanel tweed outfits. It has like gorgeous pants as well. I was like, when the hell did I buy this? And to think that there are a lot of outfits like this in my wardrobe that got missing in there. My wardrobe is a mess, you guys. I cannot wait to declutter my wardrobe because there's a shitload of outfits in there that I've never worn that has probably gotten missing or forgotten in there. But yeah, I found this one interesting because it falls into my type of aesthetic for this year, 2024. We're onto that grown woman aesthetic. So yeah. The heat is too much for my non-Nigerian viewers. If I don't try this on, don't be mad at me because the heat, the heat, 
okay the hit is crazy so we have this final we have this final uh outfit this is from petals lagos <sighs> yo yo pardon me okay it's hot okay i, sw I switched off the ac because i'm not using an external mic and you know this is what i do for my babies um yeah as you can tell the favorite color is always Ta-da, you guys um now i don't like that a particular brand starts trending and all of a sudden all the girls want to wear it i like to stand out okay no shade but i like to stand out but um i've been seeing this on my tl for a while but what caught my attention for this at leisure wear is the fact that it is a white leg pant they have a variety of other stuffs on their page but this one caught my attention because I want to be in my Pilates princess era this year. I want to have like, you guys know, if you watch my vlogs, you see that I casually wear at leisure wear on days where I want to feel like productive, okay? So yeah, I cupped this and I'm slowly building my collection of like, you know, cute at leisure wears that I'm going to wear to Pilates, I'm going to wear to the spa, you know, just be cute, doing girly things, you know? Uh, I always complain that I don't attract the, the male, the female audience a lot. So this is me constantly making efforts and being intentional because I want the girlies to be able to like come on here and see content that they relate to. Okay. So if you've gotten to this part of the video, don't forget to like my video. Please, please like my video. Liking my video would help YouTube suggest my video to a wider audience. And while you subscribe, let me quickly go, uh, you know, try on the outfits and you guys can tell me your favorite in the comments, okay? Okay guys, so these are the pants. If I were to rate this, they will have like an easy, an easy 9 out of 10, okay? I love the crisscross in front. And I love the cart yes yes pro tip if you want to feel more productive invest in more at leisure wears yeah right, hold on let me tuck this top in real quick so you guys can see what we're working with when i tell you that i am obsessed with this pants okay i do not think that i've ever given pants I've never given any outfit 10 out of 10 on this channel, okay? This will be the very first time that I give an outfit a 10 out of 10. What? I am obsessed with this outfit, the cut out, the, the pants rather. The cut out, the color, the pocket, the length. Ah, it's so perfect. Can you guys see? Oh my God. I am living through this already. I can't wait to wear it. Tell me this is in your favorite right now in the comments. Swear that this is in your favorite. What do you think about the pants? Okay, let me know. Let me know what you think about it. Let me try on the next one. So what do we think about this one? I absolutely love tweed, like I said, and I think this is the perfect fit. It is a loose fit. But it is also perfect. I, as you know, I live alone, and I could not get myself to zip it up to the end. Actually, let's try. You guys do know that I have that superpower of zipping up myself. Okay. Oof. That that's 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 the most I can do. But this is what it looks like. I'll probably need to wear a handless bra for this. This is not the right bra for this fit. But I absolutely love the color. I love the fringe detailing as well. I do love that I can wear this, style this in a different way every time. I, I'm also, I'm already thinking about wearing like a white shirt inside while styling it. It's giving very much tea girl aesthetic. I love it. Imagine wearing this with like pink Manolos. Oh, chef's kiss. What do you guys think? Rate this one. I'm not gonna rate this one. I particularly feel biased 
I don't know what some of the girlies feel about Sheen, but I feel like this tweet didn't do bad. If it's styled pretty well, it will probably be mistaken for one of them Chanel tweet dresses. But let me know what you're going to score this in the comments. Let me try on the next. Whoa. Ah! I don't see how you can hear from my side of the club. You can't even get in. <laughs> no. Hold on. Babies. Okay, forget all that. I'm at the risk of y'all seeing my coochie, okay? Now, this is the outfit I was telling you that I got when I was cupping my friend's birthday present. And while it seems like everything is perfect, the buttons. Let me tell you, the problem of being a big girly is we don't do well with outfits with buttons in the middle. Because tell me why I had to use safety pins to literally pin some of the button areas because it's literally like opening. I hope y'all don't see my coochie. Oh my god. Oh my god. But yeah, um, this is what we're working with. Um, I, I noticed that um, two, dress, the two dresses from this haul have like pink detailing. Does this mean that I'm in my pink girly era though? We'll see. We'll see. But yeah, I would rate this a comfortable 8 out of 10. I really love this dress. If you guys know me, you know that I love outfits that are cut out. Okay, so the owner of this brand has to be so intentional. Knowing that the fit girlies also want to be stylish, also want to show off their body is key. Okay, so I'm just like, what are the odds that this exact style of outfit that I love is already made in this outfit? Okay, because I don't be finding stuff like this already made. Stuff that can fit the girlies and stuff that can fit, you know. <laughs> you know. But yeah, I absolutely love it. I love the tying, detailing. This is, of course, not the perfect uh, bra fit for this outfit. But yeah, I love it. I can wear this to the beach. I can see myself wearing this to lounge at home. I can see myself just wearing this to feel sexy. Yeah? Tell me what you think about this one, though. Do you think it's worth the 8 out of 10? Even though I have to struggle with y'all seeing my coochie? Okay, you guys. My babies. What do we think? Okay, so I have heard this... Juliet Moses and Sabrina Bella collab mesh top with this pants. I have never worn this pants before, but somehow the heat, the moisture in this apartment has destroyed my new outfit. And I hate that! Anyway, um, this is what we're working with. Uh, I don't want to break the mesh top. I'll obviously read the mesh now. It's 10 out of 10, okay? And don't even be saying that it's my besties that own the brand and that's why I'm being biased, okay? Y'all need to cup one to understand what I'm talking about, okay? I love the shimmer detailing. I love that it's extra stretchy. I love that it doesn't feel uh, harsh on your skin. As for this pants, I don't hear if it changes color like a camellia, I'm still going to wear it. And y'all better act like you know when you see me. Imagine pairing this with my Diesel 1DR bag and my D-square silver shades. A look. Oh, I love it. Yeah. 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 Read it in the comments. Tell me your favorite one. <laughs> All right, my baby, so I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Um, I, I, like I said, I procrastinated about this because of the house hunting, but I had to take a brief, a brief pause to bring this video to you guys because you guys are more important, okay? Um, don't forget to share my video don't forget to subscribe we're on the road to 5k and i'll really really appreciate that you share my video and subscribe and let me know your favorite outfits let me know how often you want to see fashion hauls and yeah i will definitely see you on my next one bye please welcome back to the channel
Oh my god, I'm so tired. Yeah,